Good morning you guys, rise and shine, look alive, it's morning time and I'm about to start my day. I'm going to show you guys exactly what I do, what my day consists of and basically what my life is like now that I have a little baby. So it's about uh, 7 o'clock right now, 6.45, 7 o'clock. Um, Saray and I have been up for a little bit, I fed her, I've changed her, now she's just behind me on her little uh, blanket, if you can see her little body. She's just playing around, um, and I've already brushed my teeth and like rinsed my face off. So as soon as she's fed and everything in the morning, she can play by herself for a little bit while I kind of get that stuff done, which is really awesome. And then her and I go ahead and have some playtime. I am like exhausted. We actually went to bed around 10 and got up around 6-ish, but I still feel really tired like I do most mornings anyways. Um, but it like takes me about 15 20 minutes to like get up and get going anyways enough blabbing i'm sure there's going to be much more time for that in this video let's go meet baby girl and have some morning cuddles kisses and playtime like we usually do good morning baba good morning good morning good morning honey say good morning can mommy have big smiles? Yeah, big smiles for mommy. Yeah. Yeah. How was your sleep? How was your sleep? How was your sleep? It was good. Okay, good. <laughs> Are you ready to start our day? Yeah? Okay, good. Okay, let's go. Let's go. This is her little baby outfit of the day. She's got her I Love Mommy onesie on. I'm kidding. I'm going to actually change her after I wipe her down and give her a little bath. But I usually do that uh, in the afternoon. <laughs> oh, bless you, Mama. <laughs> bless you, honey. Um, not in the afternoon, but literally after I have breakfast and sometimes after she has her first nap, I'll give her a quick wipe down and I'll give her uh, like a deep bath like maybe three or four times a week. So time for us to make breakfast. Okay, you guys, so I am going to go make myself um, an iced coffee and have like a little morning snack. And while I do that, I put her in her little vibrating bouncy chair. And then I let her watch um, some TV, some cartoons, and it usually keeps her, you know, like distracted and she's okay. Um, so yeah, she'll either watch the TV or she'll play with like the monkey or the elephant. She'll just stare at them. This is a really good uh, toy. I got it as a gift for my best friend. And yeah, she'll be okay uh, on her own. Um, I'm just in the kitchen anyway, so if she's crying or getting fussy, I'll be able to hear her. So let's go do that. Ooh, Arthur is coming up next. I love Arthur. Okay, you guys, so I drink my iced coffee and have my peanut butter and banana uh, while Soraya is, you know, still entertained with Arthur. Um, and it gives me time to relax. I'll also sometimes write in my agenda. I've already wrote down what I need to do for the next couple of days, but if I needed to do planning, I would go ahead and do it now while she's quiet and uh, entertained. Okay you guys, so when Soraya goes down for her naps, I really use the time to try and get stuff done around the house. So first things first is I'll set up her little bath. Like I said, I don't give her a deep bath in her baby bathtub every single day, just because she's not getting super dirty, she's not crawling yet, she's only two and a half months. So I just set up some water in this basin and I use my favorite products of choice. After that's all done, I try my best to just clean up, do some cleaning, so I'll do laundry, sweep, do the dishes, 
uh, and then I will work out. Also, I'm not including any of my meals just because I plan on doing a video on my pregnancy weight loss, just everything I've been eating um, to lose the baby weight. I've been doing a really great job so far, so just stay subscribed if you want to see that. And she's awake, so we're having our little bath time. I only use the pink cloth with water to wipe her face, no soap. And then I'll add some uh, soap to the little plastic basin and I'll wipe down her body. Saray loves bath time. She's such a playful, precious little girl. Like, I love her so much. This is her little outfit of the day that I picked out for her, um, but after I fed her, she literally just dropped asleep. Um, she actually didn't stay asleep for that long, maybe like 15, 20 minutes. Um, so as soon as she got up, I decided to do some tummy time with her, which I try and do every single day to build neck strength. Um, and she's doing such a great job at it, and she has since I brought her home from the hospital. Also, if you're still watching and you haven't given me a thumbs up on this video already, what are you doing? Give me a thumbs up for this strong baby. Look at her go. She's so strong. Now that the nicer weather is upon us, I try and take her outside as much as I can. So on the days that I don't work out, <laughs> she's like, what is going on? What are you holding? On the days that I don't work out, I take her out for longer walks um, just to get my exercise in and to just let her get outside and get some fresh air. Yes, baby, we're going to go for a walk. We're going for a walk, honey. Uh-huh. Yes, a walk. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and change her into her outside clothes. I like to just keep her in something like this inside um, I'm gonna change her into her outside clothes, and then we're gonna go for a little stroll A little stroll. A little stroll. So I changed her diaper I fed her again, and I changed her into her outside clothes because I was getting ready to go outside for a walk um, but She fell asleep So I just let her sleep of course Okay guys, so I have been asleep, um, so Saraya was still asleep when I got back from eating my lunch around 3, so I went to lay down and I just woke up and it's 5 o'clock now, so hi mama, I got a good little nap in and she t just took her longest nap of the day which is good, um, it's hot in here and it's a little bit cooler outside, I can feel like a breeze coming in, so now we're going to go for a walk. Now we're going to go for a walk. Um, uh, these days literally just like fly by. It's insane. Um, but of course, you know, I'm feeding her. I'm... Yes, Mama. 
I'm feeding her, I'm playing with her a lot more than I show. Um, being a mom is a full-time job. It's hard work, um, but it's such rewarding work. Um, so yeah, let's go for a walk now if you want to stay awake. You gonna stay awake? Yeah? Yeah? Are you trying to poop? Are you trying to poop? Are you trying to poop? Yeah. We gotta get it up before we go. Get it up before we go, okay? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna wait a couple of minutes and see if she poops just so I don't have to rush home to change her diaper. But yeah. And we're off. Saraya usually stays awake for the most part during our walks. She loves to look around to see what's going on. She loves to look at mummy and see what mummy's doing. Um, so walks with her are always great. I try to take her out when it's cooler and when it's not too, too hot. Um, and I try to get her inside before any like bugs or mosquitoes or anything like that uh, start to come out. And then after our walk, we'll go back inside. We'll have some more playtime and I'll wipe down her face and her hands. This is really important. I do it every single time we come back from like a walk or even if we're at family and friends uh, houses. I just like to just give her a quick little clean. It's literally just her face I'm wiping down and her hands because you know outside there's a lot of dust and dirt and sometimes when you're seeing family you know people love to touch her face and her hands so I just make sure I get that done. Um, after this I went ahead and put her back in her chair while I prepared my dinner and before you know it it was nighttime. I fed her Again, I changed her and I put her to sleep. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to us if you want to see more of us. And we will see you guys in another video. Bye.